Hero Memes and Broskies is Meme Shop Incorporated, and if you wouldn't mind clicking that beautiful sub box, it would make my day. Also, clicking the like and favorite doesn't hurt either. Now back to the topic at hand. Today, I wanted to talk to you guys about Call of Duty and all of its games in general. So basically, Call of Duty, you know, it's just that first person shooter game that everyone either likes to rant about or likes to praise. And I think it lost its charm after MW2. Now, everyone can agree Black Ops was a pretty bad game. Except for zombies, and now Black Ops multiplayer is alright, at most. But it, it was never really good, or definitely not great, except for zombies, because zombies was just so much fun. And, uh, I, I thought MW3 was... Let me put it this way, the only, we the only reason I play MW3 is to get videos for you guys. I do not like that game. Do not, do not, do not like that game. And sadly, I think Black Ops 2 is heading in the wrong direction. I mean, Moving to the Future is sort of really dumb. I know I just said sort of really dumb, so I guess I can't really say that I'm the smartest person on the planet, but Black Ops 2, it just doesn't look very fun. There aren't enough innovations, and it looks like it's moving totally in the wrong direction because of the future thing. Seriously, it's just not good. I mean, I'm still gonna buy it just because, I, you know, it's just something you do. It's not really you really love it enough to buy it just because you want to play it a lot. I'm only playing it, and I'm only buying it for zombies. I just, I don't feel like Black Ops 2 or anything is going in the right direction except for zombies in Strike Force mode, which I've talked about in my previous videos. And it's going to rock. Zombies is going to destroy. But... Also, just as a little side note, Halo 4 is going to be amazing. Anyways, back to Black Ops 2 and Call of Duty in general. I loved Call of Duty 4. It's still an amazing game, and I like to play it, like, right here. I try not to get infections, but if I get into a lobby and it won't allow me to pause, it's kind of hard to quit because it won't let me pause. Now, I think Call of Duty... 4 was a great game, but my favorite was World at War. I don't know why, it was just something about its charm. It was just fun to play. It had zombies, and that was the first time you ever saw zombies. It had the very greatest zombie map there ever was, Deer East. Now, Deer East was the giant, I believe, translated from German to English, and it was a fantastic zombies map. It was super fun. It introduced the pack punch machine. You could get Jug, Speed Cola, all that stuff. And then we got MW2, which was Call of Duty on a whole new level. And it was just, it was so much fun to play. The campaign, I thought, was great. May it be a little short, but it was still, it was great to play. The kill streaks were new. Everything was good about this game. I loved it. Except, well, the graphics were a little dated, although for their time, I guess they were okay. But there weren't anything like Battlefield Black Company 2 graphics or the X-Men Origins Wolverine cutscene graphics. But, you know, I digress. But then we got Black Ops. Like I said earlier, Zombies was the only good thing about it. It was alright multiplayer, so that was okay. It, it was okay to bad. And then we got Modern Warfare 3 this year. So... They copy and paste in MW2. That's the game. There we go. And they added a new campaign. And then a total of like three guns are new. Then they reskinned all the skins to make it worse. But what can I say? Like I said earlier, the only reason I play it is so I can get videos for you guys. I really don't like MW3. Love Call of Duty 4, love World of War. Too bad both of them are hacked, except World of War is a little more extreme than Call of Duty 4. And Call of Duty 4 is still playable, unlike World at War. It's just, it's hard to explain, but... Uh, I just, I love World at War for some reason. But also, Call of Duty 2 and 3. I would talk about Call of Duty 1, or Call of Duty Classic, as some know it. But I just, I have never played it, and I don't have it, obviously. Uh, so, here, uh, I love Call of Duty 2. I love it. I played the campaign so many times, and I, ugh, it's just so much fun. I've been a veteran, I've been, I've, I've done everything you can do in that game. It's so much fun. In Call of Duty 2, it's, like, it's World of War at its best. Well, 
except for World of War was my favorite Call of Duty. It's uh, World War Two at its best. And then Call of Duty 3, it was... It was okay. It was like Black Ops, except better. It wasn't near as bad as Black Ops, but it didn't bring zombies to the table either. So, I'd say it's equal to Black Ops, only for the reason the Black Ops had zombies. Now, it was an okay, it was definitely more realistic, and I feel like the campaign was just a little more enjoyable. I don't know why, I don't know if that was just me, but what usually made me mad is when you were walking your crosshairs, they wouldn't just open up, they would just disappear. I don't know why that always annoyed me, but, you know, it just did. And, yeah, I loved Call of Duty 2. Loved it to death. And I, I liked Call of Duty 3, so... Basically, what I'm trying to say is Call of Duty is moving in the wrong direction, and I just really wish it would move back to the classics, because the classics were the best. Call of Duty 2 was spectacular. Call of Duty 3 was good, and MW1, amazing, and so forth. It got bad from MW2. This is Name Shop Incorporated. Thank you for watching. Out!